All right, everybody, it's time to play The Sims 3 with the Crosbys. Uh, here we go. All right, here we go. It's the Crosby household. It looks like it just started snowing. I thought that it was actually done with winter. I thought we were done with that last time. There's some horses kicking over cans. That's that's our neighborhood. Uh oh, here we go. Right off the bat, it looks like Gracie here is gonna have her little vampire baby. So we better take her to the hospital. Come on now, guy. Take her to the hospital. Oh, here we go. Guy has. Uh, they have twins. Little twin van. Oh, oh, what is going on back here? Well, that guy's clawing at the bench. Guy's like, well, this is fascinating, but you have twin babies now, guy. Oh, boy. Well, it's like, no matter what I do, she just absolutely will not go for it. She does not want to. She doesn't want to move in. She doesn't want to get married. She doesn't want to do anything. Seems like nothing is working. How's the. The relationship status is quite high. Oh, she's got commitment issues. Oh, boy. Of course. Of course. Oh, oh my. Oh, well. You talked her into sleep. You're a boring, boring fellow. All right. He's, he's casually strolling away. All right, then. Off he goes. Well, a guy. Oh, he's having a good time. And he's, and he's very tired. Oh, what's this? I don't care. Go for it. So, guy's not going to get his little vampire lady over here. Because she's got commitment issues. So her and all of the babies, they're not gonna, they're not gonna move in. Well, they're not gonna move in voluntarily. <laughs> oh, what's, oh my gosh, Rita is just being terrorized over here by ghosts and aliens and all these things. Oh, and it's Ashley's birthday. Hooray! Good job, Ashley. You're finally an adult. Oh, look at you. All grown up looking pretty much exactly the same as you did just a moment ago. Oh, man. Wait, what? What is this? All of Monique Crosby's belongings? Did, wait a minute, did Monique die? Well, when did this happen? Did I miss this? But, uh, Monique? But she was a frog. A frog lady. <laughs> uh, would you like to come over? Oh, sure, we'll all be over soon. Oh, looks like the children can't make it. Hmm. We'll see. Oh, now what is this? I have an evil Mr. Gnome here. And I can give him a name. Wendell. Oh, you know, I like that, actually. That'd be Wendell. Let's put him somewhere. There's a good spot. He looks pretty evil. Is he going to come to life and terrorize the place? Look at that cat. Oh. Sure, let's do that. Lakeisha's over here dreaming of the money that she could have. Ooh, and the job and the raise she could have if she was alive, but she's not. Dora still fixes things, but Lakeisha, she does nothing. She does nothing. Where's that inventory? There it is. Look at this. Return. Return, Lakeisha. Get out of here. Go back to the netherworld, Lakeisha. Goodbye. It was fun having you around for a little while, but now back you go. Now what is going on here? What are you doing at my mailbox? In your underwear. She's gonna run away. What's she gonna do? Knock over trash cans? Who is this lady? Oh, Gracie just will not come over. I'm sorry, guy. I'm sorry. She just, she doesn't want to deal with you anymore. That was fast. 
Got a little too heavy on the, uh, on the commitments there, I think. I don't think I want to spend any time with you right now. Oh, man. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. Yeah, he's confused. Well, they don't seem to have a home or something. They disappeared. They're not happy with you, guy. They are not happy with you. Oh, Gracie wants to talk. Oh, but you're in the bathtub. Get out of the bathtub. Talk on the phone. Yes, did you make it? Would love to chat. Yes, please. Oh, yes. Ghost cat makes a ghost poop. Oh, no, that is a... That's a, that's a, a cross through the heart. Oh, that seems bad. What's this? Oh, uh, we, do, we don't care. Whatever. Do your thing. Oh, this town practically has no people in it. Everybody's gone. There's somebody who lives there. Gameplay. What is this? I must have downloaded that or something. I don't, I don't know what that means. Oh. Oh, God. What's happening? Oh, uh, something bad is happening over here. Oh, there's that, there's that Grim Reaper. What's he here for? Oh, for Dean? Oh, Dean. Poor Dean. Oh, the cats are sad too. Well, let's move his uh, little gravestone outside. And we'll put it in the graveyard. Out here in the back. I think this house is getting way too big for uh, a couple people and some ghosts. What do we have? We have Ashley, Guy, and Rita here who keeps passing out. Where's she at? There she is, standing in the rain. At least she's awake right now. Oh, off she goes. Wait a minute, look at this. Why is Wendell over here? And he's looking, he's looking like that laugh is his. He's, he's all scratched up though. I wonder if the cats did that. Will he get his revenge on the cats? That's right, drink. Drink your troubles away, guy. Uh, having another, are you? Yep, that's how it goes. There she is again. This lady keeps coming over, putting stuff in our mailbox, and then stripping down and running away. What's the story with her? Is she going to go run next door again? There's nobody that lives there. Nope, she's just going to run off down the street this time. Uh, Ashley's invited her uh, her boss over. Her boss happens to be a werewolf. She says, oh, you're a very... Oh, what? Oh. He's a good werewolf with some nice fur. Oh, that, all right. Oh. Oh, they get along quite well. Wait a minute, look at this. It's Wendell. He's upstairs now. He looks like he's floating, too. Is he floating? He's definitely floating. I don't understand what this guy does. He's an evil little gnome. I never see him move. Did he just, does he just appear in other places? There we go. Guests are beginning to show up for the party. It looks like uh, Ashley's little clone is here. We've got, uh, there's the werewolf man. The children. Yeah, everybody's, uh, everybody's having a good time. Everybody come on in. It's time to go. No, no. No one leaves. No one leaves. No one goes. You all have to stay. 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 <laughs> Stay forever. Oh, very good. Oh, you found a kitty. Oh, that's very nice. Would you like to stay with the kitty forever and ever? Oh. oh. You have to go, do you? And where are you going to go? Nowhere. There's nowhere to go. You're all here. You're all here with me now. It's practically the whole town, including Guy's vampire family that just doesn't want to come over. Uh, let's see how the party's going. How is everybody down here? Oh, look. You've got yourselves a little playroom, don't you? 
Very nice. Oh, you're tired? Oh, no. Hmm, yes. You all have your own private little rooms. That's a good party, right? Hello, werewolf man. You, you can come and go as you please. We're fine. Ah, uh, Gracie says that she has to go. She has things she's got to do. But you can't. You can't go. You can't leave. Ha <laughs> ha You're gonna go off somewhere else and disappear. But now, no. Now you're here to stay. Well, let's just get rid of these walls down here. We don't need everybody to be in separate cells or anything. I'm not a monster. Good gravy. They just all have to stay in the basement forever until they die. Look at this guy. He's like, why are you on the bed? I want to be on the bed. Aw, oh, little vampire boy. Oh, very smelly. How do you feel about this basement dwelling? Do you enjoy it? Do you like it? Yes, they all have to go somewhere. They can't. This is their life now. All right. Well, I think I've tortured enough people for today. Uh, that, oh boy, the next one is going to be very interesting. We're going to have a whole mess of people all locked down in the basement to live out their lives. All right, well, that's all there is for now. Anyway, like and subscribe, and you can see more of this next time when I play even more of The Sims 3 with the Crosbys. Oh, that's right, Rita. It smells. I'll just keep on doing it. Uh, she's having a good time. <laughs>